Okay, Felicity, before we start to talk about what you've come here to see me for today, I just wanted to raise an issue with you. I think that we've both realised when you walked in here that we've seen each other um, around before. Yeah, you're Jake's mum. I've seen you at kindy. That's right, that's right. We do um, run into each other uh, a fair bit at the kindergarten. So I suppose what that brings up for me is that I'm a psychologist and there is certain boundaries that um, I have to uphold with my clients and I think that we need to talk about what we're going to do about this that we we do see each other um, quite often and how we're going to manage that in terms of um, you know keeping those appropriate boundaries um, within therapy and, and outside the therapy room okay yeah so how I see it is we have a few different options yeah um, the first one is that we could um, decide not to engage in therapy together okay. um, given that you know there could be some issues when we see each other outside of therapy okay how would that option sit for you well um, I guess Part, part of the problem for me is that I really I feel that I really need to talk to someone about what's going on for me and, and I'm, I don't really there's no one else in town I can talk to okay yeah Psycho- psychology services are quite limited in this area aren't they they really are yeah they are okay so you really feel that you need the help and this is the only option that you've got yeah so given that that's the case how do you think we could manage this when we do run into each other outside of the therapy room so that we don't cross over, you know, the boundaries of therap- okay. therapist and client? Okay. So if I see you at the kindergarten, shall we um, acknowledge each other and, um, you know, keep walking or, or how would you like to manage it? Um, no, I mean, I think I think it's good if, you know, if we can, like, say hi and stuff, but, I mean, I probably, I probably wouldn't want to talk to you at kindy about what we do here in case other people hear it sure sure and I'm really glad that you brought that point up because I think that given that we will run into each other quite a bit at the kindergarten it's fine for us to acknowledge each other but we do need to keep the therapeutic issues that we talk here in therapy for therapy yeah yeah um, yeah yeah I'm glad that you think that it that would not be appropriate outside yeah, of therapy yeah. also yeah and I mean you wouldn't you wouldn't tell any of the other mums, would you? No, no. I, I'm. I will definitely keep it um, confidential that we're in a therapeutic relationship yeah, together, okay, and nobody okay. else needs to yeah be aware of that. Okay, so it's kind of like we've got therapy for in here, but then out there we're just mums. That's exactly right. So if we could just keep it at you know those things separate, then I don't think we should run into any, um, any problems in therapy. Yeah. But perhaps we could check in from time to time to see um, you know whether that's becoming a problem for us. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That sounds good. Do you think that sounds okay? Yeah. All right. So now that we've um, discussed that issue, yeah. Let's talk about why you've come in to talk to me today. Okay.